Hi YouTube, how's it going? Today we're going to be playing a game called Point and Click Killer. I found it on itch.io like all of my other games. I don't even need to say it anymore at this point. Alrighty, the description for Point and Click Killer is you've been driving all day and can barely keep your eyes open when you finally see the lights to a motel. Maybe they will have a vacancy. Maybe you will get more than you bargained for. It actually looks pretty interesting. It doesn't seem like a game I've ever really played before, and there's also a sequel to it, so if this is good, I'm also going to be playing that. I'm not entirely sure how long this is, um, nor if it's a really good game. However, I wanted to play it. It seems interesting enough, and without further ado, let's go ahead and play. Point Click Australia, 1976. Eight hours on the road, and I couldn't keep my eyes open. That's when I saw the motel sign, and decided to stop for the night. The person at the reception seems overly excited to see you. Motel attendant, what you got for me? Well, evening, sweetheart. Welcome to Point Click. You lost? Mm, no, I'm looking for a room for the night, please. Sure thing. Room 13's available. Here's the key. You can pay me in the morning. I don't think any motel does that anymore. Oh, do I gotta go back outside? No? 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 Okay, alright. Well, where's room 13 at, brother? I don't even have the key. Oh, there's the key. I'm a little... Thanks. Have a good night. I was a little I was a little goofy there for a second. Alright, where is room 13? Room 11, 12, 13. What if I try room 11? It's locked. I need to use my room key to open it. That sure is a shame that we don't have the key to open that door. Let's try room 12. <laughs> oh, uh, it's locked. I need to use my room key to open it. Okay, alright, well I guess. Let's go and use the key on our door. It was a little abrasive. Oh my. Jesus! It's actually quite a nice room. Hopefully, I can get a good night's sleep. Small television. Okay, yeah, no. No, not dealing with that. Not dealing with that. Why do we slam every door we have? Hello? Yeah, does the sink work? Hello? You know, I'm kind of pretty though. Why am I? Why am I kind of pretty? Why am I looking at me like that? My eyes look so different. <laughs> yeah, that ain't you. That ain't you. Oh. What happened? I th think I blacked out for a while there. That ain't you. All right. I really need to go to bed. No, you need to call a uh, uh, an exorcist. Does the pisser work? I'll take that as a no. All right. Well, I don't think there's much else to do other than go to sleep. Comfortable looking bed. You slip, thankfully, into a deep sleep. A piercing scream from outside startles you awake. What on earth is going on out there? A ghost murdered that, that poor person. Oh my god. Someone's been stabbed to death. I'd better call the police before the killer escapes. Yeah, well, that killer's gone. He went through the wall. It's Casper. Sorry to tell you. Whoever that was outside is now trying to get into your room. You need to try to escape or hide. Uh, uh, uh. They broke through the front door. I think they're now in my room. Okay, well, how about you stop standing there and move? Um, um, uh, I think I, ooh, ooh, I, a maintenance manhole. Okay, all right, I didn't. Why is there a maintenance manhole down here? I need to go. What is that thing, hello? No, I'm gone, no, 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 I'm not even. It's a massacre! No, they're in the bathtub, they're literally- There's just blood everywhere! I need to get out of here! 
I'm starting to think that the the motel manager is. Uh, I don't know what key I got. What key is that? A car key. Okay. The motel manager isn't. A lunatic is on the rampage. I need to get to the police station. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. Red car. You can't use that. Okay. All right. Uh. Uh. This car. You can't use that. Okay. All right. Fair enough. I respect it. Uh. You can't use that. Okay. All right. Well, I don't. I don't really know the point of giving me a car key that I can't use. What if I just run to the police station? I guess. No. All right. Okay. All right. Fair enough. I'm bad. I'm sorry. It's locked. I'm not going back into my room for the key. Okay, that one was my car. I don't know how I forgot that. Let's use, let's just, uh, let's just, uh, let's, it's without the key. Ossifer! Ossifer! Oh my god, the police! Officer, help me! Freeze! Get your hands up! Officer, help me! There's a killer chasing me! All right, stay calm. Where's this killer now? Behind you? Wait, how did he even... Oh, he is so, so deceased. Anyway, office, officer? <gasps> <gasps> I told you the killer was behind you! Wait, now I'm confused. Wait. Huh? Hey, Car 42. You just get back from the motel? Anything going on? Nothing out of the ordinary. It was all quiet. Damn. It's always quiet out there. <laughs> That's what you thought. Dead. Quiet. <laughs> All right. Oh my god. All right, I felt like the first one was a bit too short. So we'll go on and play the second one. This is the Point Click Killer Act 2. The loading screen looks exactly the same. Oh, hello, options. Minus the, uh, minus the, yeah, the officer down there. Let's go ahead and play. Point click Australia, 1976. An old lady had stumbled on the body of Officer Grimes, Rick, this morning. More bodies were located inside the motel shortly afterwards, and the crime scene was quickly established. A few miles away, you were just starting to wake up after a long night at the office. Were you a detective? We're not the murderer? Your emergency pager starts to beep frantically. Yeah, we're definitely, we're definitely an officer. Hmm. What are you playing, the Tetris game? Hello? Murder Motel 187. Okay. Detective Clark. Got it. You get up and into your clothes quickly. 187 is code for a major murder investigation. Oh my god, okay, alright. Let's see, beeper. Yeah, let's grab our beeper, we need that. Okay, we got a cute little cozy home. West Virginia Mountain Mama, hello? Let's grab our detective tools. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what that would really entail, but... What's up with us slamming every damn door? Good morning, Steven! Joan, across the street, waves to you. Lovely old lady, but a little nosy. Morning, Joan. Crazy old hag. Anyways, let's get in my car. Plane, car, car crash. Nope, never mind. All right. Nope. Okay. All right. Am I? 
<gasps> I'm driving? I don't know where I'm going. They're just really letting me drive? Where? Oh, I think that's where I need to be. Hello? No? Where am I going? This? Oh, yep. Yeah, yep, yeah, definitely this. That's the hotel right there. P-O-I. L, backwards L, motel. Alright, let's see. Thank God you're here, sir. We're keeping the public and media well away for now. Let us know if there's anything we can do to help catch this psycho. It's not a psycho. It's not, I swear. I am them. Body of Officer Grimes. Yes. Yes, yeah, PMI one. Clean stab wound in the neck area. Likely made by a sharp kitchen knife. Yes. He wasn't circumcised before, but he is now, okay? Alright, the murder took the victim's clothes as well. They wanted to see him naked. So likely they're posing as a police officer. The murderer took the victim's boots and sucked his toes. Which means their feet were likely the same size. About nine. No sign of the murder weapon anywhere in the vicinity. They likely took it. Yes, that's a good... That's a good deduction. Let's see. Let's go over to this little red car over here. Let's see. License plate... B... P E nine two. Yep. All right. Got it. Oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, wait. Okay. He's just moving around. All right. Let's go into room eleven. That was the that was the room with the manhole. No. Don't slam it. They slammed it. Ooh. Body cut in half. A motel guest has been stabbed multiple times and somehow strung up from the ceiling. I'm not gonna talk about how it's literally. Are are is this two separate bodies or is the same body just split in half? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's just... Yeah. Stabbed multiple times, but we're not going to talk about how it's a straight cut. Alright. That's fine, I guess. What's on the TV? Nothing. Alright, got it. Okay. Ooh. More victims lay scattered around the bathtub. Carefully assessing these victims reveals more stab wounds, but no new evidence. Sink filled up with blood. Hasn't been used. Likely, likely it should. It should be used. I'll get the police to crawl around down here later. Okay. I don't know why you can't do it, because you're the police, but... This toilet doesn't look like it's been touched. Hmm. Good. Alright. Alright. Doesn't look like there's anything more in here. Let's take a look at room 12. I don't think I... It's locked. We didn't get to go into room 12. We can get her car key. Handprint. No fingerprints. The person who left this bloody handprint was wearing gloves. Now I'm confused. Is there two murderers? Or is it just the... How is there a, a bloody handprint? Someone remade this bed. Possibly trying to hide evidence. Right, let's check out this bathroom. I'll get the police to crawl down there later. Okay. Well... I am a little confused, because I saw one of the deceased. Can I talk to y'all? It's locked. I could try to force it, but the key might be here somewhere. Yeah, I have the key. How about we start using our brain? Let's see, what are we working with? An old lantern. I wonder why they have an old lantern. letters from a Vanessa Smith. No address? I need to get some more details about Vanessa. Okay, well, open the letter. You can't use those together, huh? 
Huh? Okay, well, I don't want to use them together. I just want to... Okay. There's nothing in the center console. Not even a crumb. Dang. I was hungry, too. Let's see. I mean... Doesn't really seem like much else is in here. So I guess... We're going to get out the car. I need to pay a visit to the police station to get more answers. I suppose we could do that. Let's go get him. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. I want them to crawl around in the bottom. Mm. I should have told them to crawl around in the bottom. That's unfortunate, actually. <gasps> wait, is that her? I think that might be her. That's an illegal parking. I'm writing you a ticket. She just walked over this way. If I walk over here, will I get absolutely murdered? Excuse me, sir. Oh, never mind. It's her. Yeah? How can I help? Oh, I don't need any help, Detective Clark. You do. <gasps> now let's get back to your new home, shall we? I... What is going on? Okay, I'm gonna go back into this and see if I can just go inside the police station because I walked over there to them and I didn't really think that I would actually get completely destroyed like I did. Alrighty, we made it back to the police station. Let's see if I can just go inside. Maybe I shouldn't chase after the killer, considering that I know, but he doesn't know, but I, I know, but he doesn't. So let's just go inside. I can just go inside. Oh, interesting. They're just practicing shots. It's not a big deal. Hi, officer. I'm Detective Clark. I have a few questions I'm hoping you can help me with. Sure thing. Notice anyone around here acting suspicious. Can I get an address for Vanessa Smith? Have there been a lot of murders in Point Click? Can I get an address for a Vanessa Smith? Yeah. Sure thing. One sec. Oh, here we go. There are three on record. One deceased, one moved overseas, and the other is right here in point click. Interesting. 14 Megan Street. Excellent. I'll head over there after I'm finished here. But it said driving eight, eight hours or something. You notice anyone acting suspicious around here? I know this might sound ridiculous, but have you seen any police officers coming through here acting suspiciously? I'm not entirely, like, if she's just been sitting outside. No, sir, I watch all the comings and goings, and I haven't seen anyone out of the ordinary. Sorry. Well, that doesn't help us any. Let's see. I'm kind of new to point click. Have there been any murders like the ones at the motel here before? Seems like a nice little town. I don't think that there would be. Sorry to tell you, I mean, I've lived here my whole life and haven't seen anything like this before. That doesn't surprise me, usually. There have been lots of reports recently of missing people, though. Okay. Thanks for your time. Anytime, Detective Clark. Happy to help. So let's... I'm trying to decide... I could always go to the range. Got ourselves up a Glock. Detective Clark, your range performance was excellent! Your performance was solid. Your marksmanship skills were commendable. With consistent accuracy and a tight shock ribbon. Well done. Thank you. You, you finished. Thanks, instructor. I'll see you next time. Alright, well. You heard the man. Best shot ever. Red lampshade. Okay, alright. Let's head over to 14 Megan Street. It's getting a little dark. 
Well, I don't know where 14 Megan Street is. I mean, there, there's no hints or really anything. Is there, like, any road signs I can look at? I don't think so. Oh. Oh, Steven, have you got a second? Sure, darling. Anything for you. What can I get you, Joan? Hi, Joan. Is everything okay? No, I'm not sure. Joan looks really shaken. A young lady came by here early, very pretty, asking for you. I told her you took, you had left, and then she took off in a hurry. That's strange. Yeah, I wasn't expecting anyone. She gave me the creeps, Stephen. She wouldn't stop smiling. I'm sure it's fine. You can give the station a call if she comes by again, okay? Tell you what, what you should have done, grab a little shotgun from it. Oh, I will. I just wanted to let you know. Hopefully she doesn't come by again. Joan, I'll tell you what, you gotta get that shotgun out from under your seat, pick it up, and blast her away. Alright, anyway, this clearly isn't where we need to be. Oh, Vanessa Smith's house. Wait, okay, I just had to hover over it and click. Got it. Okay. Ooh, ooh, mmm, 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 Vanessa. Vanessa. She's kind of creepy. Door's unlocked and slightly ajar. Vanessa kind of creepy. Hello? Is anyone home? Can't see my hand in front of my face. I need a light before I can go any further. Well, tell you what. I sure do have... Okay, police. Anyone here? Oh, dear lord. Oh, dear lord. Oh, dear lord. Okay. Well, I know where to go now. I need to go get that lantern from the car. I'll be right back. I swear. All right, we got the lantern. Now let's go back inside. Now that we can actually see, but I'm so confused as to what's happening. Like, who is this kid? I'm getting tired of them slamming the fucking door. Pardon my French. Ooh, there's blood. Ooh, 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 ooh. Mm. Basement. Mm. Ooh, I don't have the key. Mm. I don't got the number. Please don't scare me. I might piss myself. Vanessa! That's a mannequin. Jesus! 5455. Five, five. Got it. Kill them all. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I don't want to kill them all personally. Personally, I don't want to kill them all. A creepy mannequin stands threatening in the darkness. You're right. You're so right, King. You're so right for that, King. Honestly, you're so true. Let's go downstairs. 5455. Five, five. Got it. Okay. 5... Five, four, five, five, enter. Okay, all right, let's go down into the basement. Okay, all right, nothing creepy about the basement. Got it, okay, all right. God damn it! <laughs> Listen, don't stab me. Someone there, don't stab me. Please, for the love of God, don't stab me. I'm kind of afraid to move. I don't really want to... I don't really want to move. I'm gonna... Oh my God. Joan, is that you? Hang on, I'll find something to get you out of there. How do you see Joan? Wait, jo with the neighbor Joan? I... Joan! Joan, no! They cut off Joan's head! What do I... Where do I... How do I... Where? I'm so confused. I'm so utterly confused. Do I go back upstairs? The door's locked. You're trapped down here for now. Okay, alright. I'm about to die. Like, I'm actually gonna go over here and my head is gonna be in the barrel and not the good one. Like, I just, um, um, oh no, step bro. My head is stuck in a barrel. What do I... A letter? You want the letter? A key? You want the key? I don't know what to do. I don't know what I should be doing. Yeah, I get it. The door's locked. But how do I unlock it? Oh, sure. You can't use that? Oh. Huh. Oh, my head. What the hell happened? And also, why was Mickey Mouse there killing me? Hello? Hello? Why am I in a fucking prison cell? 
my god, a 50 cent coin. Ah, huh, you'll need it 50 cents. There's nothing in the pisser. Okay, I got it. I got it. I mean... Okay. Nothing but the toilet, the bed. There's nothing in or under the bed. Heavily barred door. It won't budge. Pole screwed into the wall for support. Use the coin on that. Get it off. Yep, the pole's freed from the wall. Yep, yep. Give me that pole. Yep, we use the pole on the door. We... With this right leverage and the proper application of strength, I can piss myself. Bingo! They should put that in a movie one day. I'm so dead though, like that is so loud. Oh my God, how many people does she have down here? Time to find a way out of this hole fast and call for help before the killer returns. Is this at the motel? Broken door is too heavy to do anything with. There is a lot of people. Like, hmm. Large empty cardboard boxes, small boxes of food and water supplies. Let's go and get us a glass of water. Everyone down here at least a month. How long have people been down here? A padlocked metal door. I mean, five, four, five, five, maybe. There's no way to break the lock on this door. Oh, it's a padlock. I'm not the brightest. Um, let's search around in the large empty boxes because maybe they're not so empty. <laughs> Left in a pile. Distant footsteps and talking. It sounds like she's coming back. I need to hide. Um. I mean, I can't really... You quickly cry... Oh my god, I'm in the bo... I'm in the boxes, okay. Yeah, sure. Jesus?! No! I'm keeping them alive with the others! Well, I'm so confused as to this, what is this? But I don't want to kill him yet. Why do you? Oh, she crazy crazy. No, you're wrong. They're my living dolls. Okay, I need to get out of the box and go because she's going to see that I'm not in there. I need to get out of the box and climb. <laughs> no! How did you get out? Where have you gone, you rat? Yes, yes, I agree. Well, then we find him. We'll kill him. <laughs> well, I'm still stuck. I'm still stuck down here. Like, what am I supposed to do? Oh my god. She's insane. I need to get help. Oh, she just didn't take the ladder up. Alright. I'll go up there shortly after her. Where am I? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, that's me? Telephone booth. I need to go to the telephone booth fast. Expeditiously. It's a big word. You proud of me? A phone booth, finally. It's time to call in some support. And I have that 50 cent coin. I... Excuse me, sir. Yes, how can I help? Oh, I don't need any help, Detective Clark. You do. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, how? Let's get you back to your home, shall we? Dude. There's gotta be another way. There's gotta be another way. Alright, so I ended up doing another playthrough of it and trying to see if I could just keep the detective alive. Um, And basically everything that I did, it just ended up uh, getting brutally stabbed in the stomach. So... From what I could tell, there is no way to keep him alive. They are working on a third one, apparently. Um, however, if there is a way, let me know in the comments and I'll go back and try it. But for now, this is going to be the end of Point Click Killer. Thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, like it. If you didn't, you don't have to. Subscribe if you'd like, and y'all have a good one.